everybody, it's Katerix, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Today we're going to be three starring Lower Bullocks. Let's get on it. I know that these first couple hospitals, I think the first three hospitals are really just about introducing all the features, and then I think after that is where you really get to play around with a lot of with like everything you have and it's a little bit more sandboxy in that way so welcome to lower bullocks it's a lovely little village with a big problem a significant proportion of the population believe themselves to be rock stars there's only one thing that can cure this psychiatry only doctors with a psychiatry qualification will be able to diagnose and treat people in a psychiatric room We've managed to find one, but you should keep your eyes peeled for job applicants with psychiatry and other useful qualifications. Okay. Um, psychiatry room is unlocked. I guess this is a GP office. Cool. That looks really neat, actually. I like that a lot. Um, as far as... Uh, psychiatry. There we go. Um, I guess we could probably put one here. I want to make, like, cool-looking rooms and stuff. Can we do something like this? And then, oh no, I don't want to move it. I don't want to move it. No, thank you. Add here, maybe? Ooh, cool, 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 cool. Okay, I like that. We'll put the door right here. Cool. <laughs> um, the hallway is small, but that's okay. It's it's supposed to be a hallway, so who cares how small it is? We can do you here. Oh, we got the nice little chair. We can put it in this corner. And I guess that's that's it. That's all we need. Because we gotta put some filing cabinets in. We of course have to put a bin in. Am I obsessed with bins? Maybe. Um, uh, we can put a plant, for sure. It's gotta be nice looking in here. We can put this Rorschach poster in. This is actually a perfect kind of room for it. This is the kind of room that it would probably be used for. So we can put it right there. And oh my gosh, a fireplace? Oh, that's fancy. Okay, we don't have that unlocked. I could unlock it, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Alright, that's pretty cool. So, we've been contacted by Bungle Technologies, who run various research hospitals across the country, or the county. They have an interesting proposition for us. Their psychiatry license was recently revoked due to an incident with, well, it's best not to go into it. They want to send us psychiatry patients and in, ex in exchange will allow us to buy some of their latest technology. Until our organization acquires a research license, we need all the technology we can get our hands on. Sure! Very, very cool. So let's get on doctors. Doctors with psychiatry, please. Uh, we do have this doctor too, right? You're a doctor? Okay, great. We have an assistant. And we have a janitor. And our janitor is you, and you actually do have the ghost capturing ability. Cool. So let's make sure we build... I just like talking into a microphone. <laughs> let's make sure we build all the rooms we need. So let's make sure we do, like, a pharmacist over here. She could be, like... Pharmacist could be, like, there. Perhaps. Okay, so we'll do our pharmacy. I guess we're gonna need a nurse for that, for sure. Um, let's... We might as well grab him. He's pretty darn good at what he does. And we can do... Uh, I suppose we could do a general diagnostics room. Maybe more on the back side here. Okay. A door. There we go. There we go. Usually these kinds of beds are like in the doctor's office and usually, I don't know, usually a nurse doesn't really help with that, but in this case they do. So <laughs> it's all right. Let's get, make sure we have a fire extinguisher. Let's make sure, make sure we have one over here. Let's finish that room and new technology. A pharmacy drug mixer upgrade. Okay and a general diagnosis easy scan machine upgrade. Okay, that that could be really good. If we upgrade, um, 25% treatment power requires a janitor trained in mechanics. Is our janitor trained in mechanics? I'm not sure. Ah, oh, she is. Aubrey, you're pretty awesome. Let's upgrade our drug mixer. And then I guess we could we could upgrade the easy scan too, right? 
Okay. We upgraded machines. New illness mock starts discovered. Our doctors have discovered a new illness. Um, patients believe themselves to be one of the greatest rock stars the world has ever seen, but are sadly gaga. We'll send patients for treatment in our psychiatry. That must be these guys. Oh my god. <laughs> if this isn't Freddie Mercury, I don't know who it's supposed to be. And he farted! You're gross. Jemima vibes. Get out of here. That's ridiculous. Okay, we're working on it. We're working on curing this mock star, Spencer Ocean. That's a cool last name. I like how it's spelled differently, but it sounds like Ocean. Or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's like Ocean or something. We failed. Treatment failed. Forever a mock star. That's all right. Goodbye. I don't think you're- would your life really be so bad if you truly believed that you were a- a rock star? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, uh, but let's continue, um, expanding with the rooms that we have. So, we have a general diagnostics. Ooh, let's make a ward. Ooh, but where are we gonna put our ward? Hmm. Oh, I think that we can actually- yeah, we can buy more plots. Oh, that might be worth doing. Maybe we could buy... Oh, maybe we could buy plot three. And actually make this our ward. So we could have like a gigantic ward. Oh, it actually takes time to um, build. That makes sense. Okay, we'll wait for that. We'll wait to make our ward. Let's make a staff room for sure. Maybe we could actually make it... Um... You know, yeah. We could make it like right here. A nice little hallway for it. Would all visitors please talk silently? That's funny. Okay, uh, we can do maybe some lockers in here. Uh, drinks machine for sure. Snack machine for sure. Oh, salty snack machine. Uh-huh, uh-huh, absolutely. Uh, bin, of course, yes. Um, we could do an armchair too. We could do hand sanitizer makes sense. A plant, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, you can't put it in the corner here? That's too bad. You're listening to Harrison Wolf. Let's put it right there then. Radio. I went to the Cirque de Let's Parfait put a poster recently. up. I was impressed by how experimental the acts were till I realized it was facing the wrong way and just looking at the tent wall. <laughs> okay, I find it hard to talk over um, when these radio hosts are talking. I don't know. I I, I can't listen and talk at the same time, and I, I think it would be weird if two voices were going at the same time. Great machine upgrade. The machine upgrade is complete. Make sure we've got a few fire extinguishers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. Let's put a food pyramid here. So I have all these ter cheesy gubbins, burp, and briny brittle, which is probably all very bad for you. So remember, remember your uh, food pyramid. Put a plant here, too. Make it beautiful. Okay. Yes, staff room finished. Very, very nice. Uh, we need to get our hospital to level 6, which is fine. Cure three patients in Pan's lab. Okay, what is that? A Pan's lab. Okay, do we have people waiting for that? Uh, this guy is clearly waiting for a pans lab. So maybe we could put that in this corner here. Oh, how big does that need to be? Oh, okay, okay. Can I do something like this? No, that's not gonna work. Okay, subtract, not here. We're not making it here. Let's put it in this corner then. There we go. We can put the door here. And, oh, this machine is very big. Okay. Oh, we don't need to put anything else in it, though. All right. Okay, except I'm gonna put a hand sanitizer and a bin. And let's put some plants in. Sleeping in the, corridors. the room isn't ready yet. Oh, are these plants in the way? Uh, no, I don't want to cancel the room. I just want to... Move this. There we go. Okay, cool. And we should definitely put more areas for people to sit, for sure. I think that we can go 
Should I maybe put in like different colored benches? Maybe like a purple bench. I know I like purple, so <laughs> we'll do some posters. Why not? We can put a poster in here, in here, in here. Cool stuff. We can even do it in here. Let's put a let's put a lightheaded poster in here. Cool. We'll put that in here too. Lots of different posters and stuff. That's pretty nice. What else do we have that we can build here? I remember that we got, yes, here, a news agent. Yeah, okay. Where can I fit you in? Probably like here, right? Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. Makes sense. There's usually like some type of gift thingy. Um, like when you first walk in to, usually when I first walk into the building that my doctor's office is in, there is a, there's a small shop that has the pharmacist in it, like a shopper's drug mart or something. It's not a shopper's drug mart, but like it, it serves the same purpose. And then, um, From the they, the there world. is a kiosk that has like coffee Cup. and stuff like that, Alimentation. that you can grab as well. Uh, oh, we do need a ward. Yes, we are done here. Just a drop of rocket fuel. So let's create a gigantical ward. I'm gonna put it, yeah, I'm gonna do it like here. So we can actually fit some other things too, actually, which is fine. Um, Let's put the door, if we put the door here, um, we can put you there. One. We should be able to fit like a ton of people in this one, for sure. Okay, we should be able to get another screen. Um, you know what? We'll put we'll put a locker in. Makes sense. Maybe like a filing cabinet behind the the nurses station over here. Bins will become full. Bins, bins. Bin. Hand sanitizer. Um, fire extinguisher for sure. We definitely need one because we don't have one um, anywhere in this building at the moment. Plants. Okay, and we're good. And we'll definitely hire a nurse for this area. So we have this one right here who already has the ward management and she's grumpy and not one of a kind. That's fine. Nurses can be grumpy. Sometimes nurses are very grumpy, but that's okay. And we'll get another one too, cause you could always have some, some extra stuff. And I think I will actually go extra staff here because this is a pretty big ward and do we have how many nurses do we have now we have three we have four places for them to work this requires a doctor right so oh we got a very big queue so we're definitely going to have to make more uh gp's offices so let's do that for sure Okay, filing cabinet, and I'll, I'll decorate it a little later. We'll get another doctor. We'll get this guy. I'm thinking that um, I will actually move psychiatry probably into this building, so then this can instead be another GP's office. So maybe we can do something like that. So we can go, where is psychiatry? There it is. We can probably put it here. Okay, and then we can maybe edit this. Can we change the room that it is? Mm, no, I don't think so. I Yeah, cancel editing and can we, should we sell the room? What's that? Make jobs in this room high priority. Okay, let's just sell the room. Yeah, and then we'll make another GP's office here. Find a hobby. If you have any suggestions, please send them in. I'll keep you posted on how my search goes. Anything's better than my last hobby. Collecting traffic cones. Okay, let's decorate. <laughs> 
Isn't that just the best part anyways? Okay, so we'll do that. We will hire yet another doctor and I think we will grab, I think we'll grab both of these people because I want another doctor with the psychiatry skill. Actually, this guy might be good. Okay, because I will build a second psychiatry office over here. Excellent. I am going to have to build a waiting room somewhere over here as well. So I haven't forgotten about that. Just want to get our most basic rooms in so we can start um, bringing in some cash and stuff and making sure we can cover all of the... All of our patients' needs. Cure three patients in Pan's Lab. We do have a Pan's Lab. Are we just like not able to cure them yet or something? Uh, looks like we cured him. Or did we? Oh, we did. Okay, thank goodness because we seem to be failing a lot. So let's actually get some benches along here. We can get a not a hand sanitizer. I guess that we can put it there though. We can get a little leaflet stand. We can maybe on uh, this hallway here put more snacks. Put a bin on either side. A magazine rack. Absolutely. Actually, can I fit that? Um, where can I fit that? Maybe I can get rid of, maybe I can get rid of one of these benches. Right, put you here. And then, oh, we got our one star. Very, very nice. So we've got, we've unlocked Flottering, which is the next hospital. Cardiology, cool. And the Deluxe Olux 2. Huh, maybe that has like a better success rate or something? Perhaps? Um, what was I gonna put here? A magazine rack. There we go. And we can actually put a magazine rack over here too. A leaflet stand. We can do maybe some plants. We can definitely do a hand sanitizer. We can do some posters. We can do, what else can we plop down here? Is there nothing else? Where are my machine? There we go. <laughs> okay, I keep going past them. We can get you and we'll get the drinks machine as well. And then we will get a bin and a bin. Okay. All right, I feel like we're doing a little bit better in this area. We've got some good places for waiting. As far as the queues go, we don't seem to have too big. They're not too big. Um, you here. Okay, we're all right here. I'm gonna just stuff in like, um, maybe like a drinks machine here. And then like a bin and then maybe we could get some blue benches over here. And then maybe like this too. Okay, so that's like our mini waiting room if the ward does get too busy. And then we can have some more benches over here by the psychiatrist's office. And we can do like snack machine too. So maybe we could go snack machine, drinks machine, a bin. Let's do another, um, another fire extinguisher. And we can do couple benches here as well okay great i feel like we're doing really really good so we can get our hospital to level eight and we need to own three buildings and we need to upgrade two machines today will oh one thing we don't have is toilets okay let's definitely make a bathroom here maybe we could fit it in right here um if we can put that there Do some toilets, hand dryer. Can I fit two sinks in here? I absolutely can. Awesome. Okay, so we've got our bathroom. Um, I 
think that I could probably fit, maybe if we could do like a skinnier room here, maybe we could do something like that. Uh, most rooms have to be three by three though, is the only thing. Um, oh, cardiology. Hmm. Okay, I guess I can do a three by three room and like this hallway can be fine and then this can be more of a, uh, of like another secondary waiting room. That's probably fine. So let's do like a, let's do a filing cabinet, bin, let's do another fire extinguisher right out here. Um, hand sanitizer as well. Yes, absolutely. Uh, we'll do a plant. Plant. Plant! Plant. <laughs> and we will finish the cardiology room. We can definitely add more benches. Let's stick with the purple benches around here though. I guess we could, yeah, that looks all right. Yeah, that's fine. Lots of seating for everybody. Uh, we have so many messages. Oh my goodness, I'm not paying attention at all. Um, we've discovered Freudian lips. A tendency to pout excessively when faced with a camera. Okay, so we can fix that in psychiatry. I would... Is this patient still here? I would like to get them to wait if they can. A pharmacy emergency. A group of pharmacy patients have been processed by Holistics Hospital. Okay. Um, that should be alright. Yes, I will promote you, promote you. Constructing new buildings and... It would be great to work in a really spacious environment with lots of luxury furnishing. Get a level four psychiatry. I could try that. As far as the pharmacy patients, I feel like I really need a second pharmacy and I don't really have a ton of space for that, but maybe I could do it. Um, oh, I also need the deluxe clinic. Okay, let's build a deluxe clinic over here because we can do that really, really quickly. Um, oh, yes, we need this one too, okay. Great, so that person can hopefully get fixed. Um, where is he? I don't know, but <laughs> We could do another pharmacy over here. Great, and no, 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 I don't want to cancel the room, okay. We'll hire a nurse for it. Uh, you. Great. We should probably hire another doctor. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. E yeah, seven rooms that we need doctors to be in. So we may as well hire another one. And then I think we'll actually be okay. It looks like we might need some more nurses as well. Although even though there's not a nurse in here right now, there's also not like a queue for that, but I will hire a couple more so we can actually get you. And then let's hire you as well. Okay, excellent. Um, I think we can just fit in a little bench, like just right here for whoever is waiting on these things here. That's great. I'll no you notice that like if you do go to a hospital, um, there's kind of benches and chairs kind of scattered everywhere for anybody, anybody that uh, can fit basically. There's always like little tiny waiting rooms everywhere. And I have, I, I have the unfortunate, um, the unfortunate thing of having to go to the hospital a lot for my mother, so. So, you know, I, I frequent quite a few hospitals, so I'm kind of aware of how, of how they work. Although usually, if you're sick, you don't necessarily go to the hospital as you do go to your regular doctor. And then the hospital if you're like really bad or like dying or something. <laughs> okay, so, um, in progress for, okay, what are we waiting for? I do have another one, okay. Great. I was gonna say, I have another pharmacy down here, but everybody's waiting for this one. But this guy with this little siren um, light above his head, uh, he's definitely, he's definitely good. Like he, 
He's part of the quest. Oh my gosh, why is talking so hard? Why do I have such difficulty doing this? Maybe YouTube is like, it's not meant for me because I, <laughs> I have trouble putting sentences together. I'm very weird that way. Uh, what's the matter with you? Oh, you are... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Watching this person die in the toilet was absolutely hilarious. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh my god, I'll be okay, I'll be okay. Um, I don't really have a lot of money. Uh, what? The inspector came? Okay, well, I guess we did really well. Um, we got the monobrow, extreme hair growth caused by excessive consumption of both highbrow and lowbrow entertainment. The monobrow must be carefully removed and placed in a secure container to prevent it from escaping. We'll send the patient for treatment in our ward. Alright, cool. We're getting very busy. We're much busier than the last hospital, that's for sure. What are you guys all waiting for? We don't have like super long queues or anything, so I, I think we'll be all right. Uh, we have two nurses in here. I'm thinking that maybe we can actually just get rid of that because this is not very busy, at least right now. So we'll definitely assign a second nurse to it if it gets busy, but right now we really only need the one. We have a psychiatrist here. If I go into my staff, okay, I have actually three doctors that um, have the psychiatry skill, or I guess qualification, I guess? Well, whatever. I have three that have it, and I have two offices, so we should be just fine. Uh, perfect, we cured the entire group of patients. This has been really helpful to our reputation. Cool! Right on, we were able to get the pharmacy going. We do have this as well, and I believe this is something we can upgrade, right? Yes, so we do need to upgrade two machines. So let's definitely do that. And I'm thinking, couldn't we upgrade this too? Yeah, that's too bad. I should have saved our upgrades for this here because they didn't count. But now they do count. And I'm actually thinking that it might be a good time to hire more janitors. Rosie is like a beast over here. So we're definitely going to grab her. And let's grab Antonia as well because she also has the, um, the ghost... The ghost, the ghost thing. She can vacuum up ghosts. What the hell is it called? Ghost capture. There, there we go. We're close to award season. Award season. Let's check it out. See if we want anything cool. Oh, very nice. No deaths. Very nice. We have assistant of the year, Jess Goody. Janitor of the year, most prestigious hospital. Okay, so we've really only not won uh, these two. We got some of these in our last hospital. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. <laughs> um, I think that at this point, we're doing really well. How much is this? 75000 for that plot. 50000 for this one. I think we can grab this. Is that it for the plots? Yeah, I think we can actually grab this one. I think that won't put us in the hole too much. I think the 75,000 might be a little, it's pushing it a little bit, but then we can build this and we can actually start expanding out because we are definitely running out of room. I think we can um, add like one more room right here and then like a couple over here and then we're definitely like, we're done. We're good. Although I think the hospital is running really smoothly. Like if we hover over these things, we don't have a ton of people waiting. And we have a pretty decent reputation, and we are actually level 8. I didn't know this is where your level was. I was just like, oh, if I add more stuff, my level will go up. That's pretty cool. Um, and then we will own, we'll own three buildings very, very soon. And then we'll just be waiting on these upgrades. Yeah, it should be good. Okay, I am actually going to leave the episode at that for today. Um, Three-starring these hospitals actually takes like... A really long time so <laughs> there will be a part two of this particular hospital so thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you next time bye bye